Good morning, Martin. Nigel. You look sad. What is wrong? I'm worried about the science test today. Have you been sleeping in class again? Yes. If you would lose some mass, you might have more energy and be able to stay awake in class. I do not see how losing mass can help me. I should lose some weight. No. Mass is the amount of matter in an object. If you lose mass there will be less of you. But that is losing weight. No. Weight is how much gravity is pulling on you. If you just want to lose weight, then go to the moon. What does going to the moon have to do with losing weight? Nigel. The moon has less gravity. This is getting complicated. The moon has about one-sixth of the Earth's gravity. So if you weigh 60 pounds on Earth, you will weigh 10 pounds on the moon. Then I would have more energy and could stay awake in class? No. But you said I would weigh less. You would weigh less but all of your mass would still be there. All of my mass? I still do not know what you mean by my mass. Your fat. Your mass is all of your fat. You do not need to be rude. Sorry. Let me try this again. Less fat is less mass. Less mass is less of you. So the gravity will be pulling on you less. This will make you weigh less. I think I understand. If I have less fat, then I will have less mass. If I have less mass then the gravity will pull on me less. And that will make me weigh less. Do you want to get a cheeseburger and fries before the test? Yes. Then we can discuss Newton's first law and how mass is a measure of inertia.